everybody, it's me, Stephanie R. Bridges, and you are watching Stephanie Renee Styles. I am so super excited to be back with you today. It's been a minute, I've been a little bit under the weather, but I am feeling so much better. And today, of course, I am bringing you your favorite, and that is another swimsuit try on haul. Today we have bathing suits from Icon Swim, and Icon Swim, they are currently doing a collaboration with City Girls, and I did look at those uh, bathing suits, but those bathing suits did not look at me. So I don't have anything from that collaboration, but I do have some super cute, even sexy, more sexy than bathing suits that I've tried on before. Trying to step outside the box a little bit. So definitely, if you haven't already, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, yeah, I think that's it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Lego. <laughs> All right, everyone, so this is our first Icon Swim bathing suit. And in the past, I've tried on Shein bathing suits twice and Cup She one time. So just to give you a little comparison, Icon Swim came super, super fast, as did Cup She. Shein took a little bit longer uh, for me to get those. In terms of quality, I think Cup She is a little bit higher than She In and Icon Swim. In terms of variety, definitely She In. In terms of price point, definitely She In. But I can honestly say with Icon Swim, they have some extremely unique pieces. So they have some items that you won't see on Shein, definitely won't see on Cup She, because I think Cup She is a little bit more traditional. Um, and they have some super sexy. So if you want to go like super sexy, then definitely Icon Swim would be the one. Or if you just want something very unique. Um, they have some very unique colorways. They have a lot of uh, swimsuit covers and kimonos that um, actually go with the swimsuit. So again, this is my the first one. I got all of the swimsuits in a size large or extra large, just depending on how uh, big they went. And um, so, I mean, some of their swimsuits do go to a 2X, I believe, so definitely check the site. But this is the first one, and honestly, I can say I do not like this swimsuit at all. <laughs> and I think it might be cute on someone else, but it's just not working for me. For one, the material is um, super thin. And then for two, there's not very much coverage at all. So I don't know how much of myself is exposed, you know, especially up here. But I wouldn't feel comfortable wearing this empty wear. Like, I probably won't even take pictures in this. I don't know. And then I'm not sure if this part is what, right? Because it's all twisty turny. So I'm not sure if this is a large or extra large, but I will definitely have everything um, in the description box as far as what size I got. But this one is a no for me. <laughs> All right, so this is our next swimsuit. And as you can see, I kind of stepped outside of the box. And this one is not high-waisted. It does not color cover my belly button. It also has some strategic uh, cutouts. Now, I thought this might work for me. However, uh, the way my body is set up and these cutouts are set up, 
this was a no-go as well. If these straps down here at the bottom were a little bit wider, and maybe, you know, if the cutouts came a little higher, then that might work. But this one does have more coverage, and the uh, top is fine. I feel comfortable in the top. You know, it's off the shoulders. It's cute, it's flirty, I like the little frill. But this one is not, uh, it's, it's a no. It's a no for me, dog. <laughs> All right, so I don't think I mentioned that we do have seven bathing suits all together. This is our third one and things are starting to look up. Now, I don't particularly like this one, but they are getting better and I like this one more than the others. Of course, I'm feeling the little boy short. It gives me uh, far more coverage. And then it does go a little more high way, so it's covering the belly button. I do like this top a lot. However, they put little wires on the side and the material is thin, as I said. So one of the wires is already like poking through and poking me. So this swimsuit would be a go, but it's a little too thin and specifically because of the color. Maybe if it was black or a darker color, I would feel more comfortable in a swimming suit of this heft. But because it is this bright yellow and it's kind of thin, I just don't think it looks that good on me. So this one is a probably a no for me, but I would recommend it. Besides the fact of the wire, I don't know if you could take that out and it would still hold its shape, or if you took it out, that would be a problem. Or you might not even have that issue where it's poking out for you. Um, the other thing I will say is I did try to go outside of the box a little bit and do more with color. So I don't know that it worked that well, but I did make an attempt. So that is this thing too here. I know you see it. I know you see it. All right, you guys. So this swimming suit is smack dab in the middle at number four. I promise you this could have been number one. This could have been that stunner. Oh my goodness, do you see this right here? <laughs> do you see this right here? Oh my goodness, this swimming suit is so bomb, but it has a couple of flaws. So flaw number one is this bathing suit. Well, let me explain it. It's two pieces. So it's like a body suit or like a one piece, and then it has the swimsuit bikini top. Two issues. The one piece uh, operation here, it has a zipper in the back. Now, I don't think any swimsuit should have a zipper, but if it does, it should be like one of those industrial ones, you know, that kind of go up and down. This one has an invisible zipper. So that's just telling me that this is going to break. I mean, it has it, you know, it's working well, but I just am suspect of invisible zippers, period. But on a swimsuit, come on now. The other flaw, which is a little more fatal, is the bikini top. Like, who, who is supposed to fit in this? 
I mean, you can fit in it, but then it has this huge hole in the middle. And I just don't understand why they did that. Like, it was super sexy enough with this. They just could have did a regular top. I wouldn't even wear it around the other way, but it's like half of the width of this. So it would be like a lot of under boob. Now, if you're an under boob girl and you can't wear it front ways, you could wear it the other way and then have you know some cute under boob. But I love this swimsuit. So I think what I would do is have to just get a different top to go inside. You know, I know it would be hard to match up this orange, but oh my goodness, this bathing suit is so cute. So I definitely, definitely recommend this one. Again, it's not very thick, but for some reason I feel better like in this more muted orange color. <sighs> Sorry. But I love this suit. Now I am gonna walk up and spin, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to use that footage. Um, just because I I don't but here we go. Finally, it has happened to me. It is right, and I am, and I am where to find it. Finally, <laughs> woo! We are finally getting some wear. Oh my goodness, you guys! Now I know it's a one-piece swimsuit. I know it even has coverage on the arms. I know it is definitely thicker than all the other swimsuits, but when I say, when I say, oh my goodness, this is nice. So I feel super comfortable in this one. I could definitely wear this. No problems with popping out, falling out, moving out, anything like that. Um, I feel like this is a one you can actually swim in too. So I do know how to swim. I'm not I'm not big into swimming. I used to be when I was young. But if I wanted to jump in a pool or if I was taking my granddaughter swimming or something like this, like that, this is what I would wear. Plenty of coverage, but still super unique and cute. So I definitely recommend this one. And again, this one is thicker. I think it's a little better quality than the first ones I was trying on. And the Icon Swim price point is around $30. So I think these are all between $28 and $30. I didn't want to go beyond $30. Whereas, you know, she and swimsuits are more in the um, like $15 range, which is great. But this came quicker and I just I just love this unique design. This this one right here is definitely worth it to me. Um, again, I definitely recommend. Hey, hey. <laughs> All right, you guys, so again, I'm just loving their scuba style swimsuits. They're thicker, but not that really heavy suction thick where it's hard to get on. And they provide more coverage, which I love. And they are black, and but they add a little pop of color, a little bit of interest. So this one has the pink mesh that um, shows some skin and the pink mesh here. So it's still very um, much covered and almost conservative, 
but it's still cute. It still gives you something unique, a splash of color, while you can still be comfortable. If you want to get in the water, you can do that. So this is another fave. I just, I really like these swimsuits. I don't know if I'm like going on and on, but out of um, Cup She, um, She In, and Icon Swim, I think when I did the cup she one, I said I liked she in by a hair. But honestly, you guys, all three companies um, are doing an amazing job with their swimsuits. All of them had some hits and some misses. I would just definitely say that Icon Swim and Cup She were quicker to get to me. Cup She edged out with quality. Um, she in, of course has everything they got so much on the website um more than the other brands do but i really think in terms of just really finding some unique items that are super cute and that can work for you whether you're younger or older um icon swim they really get it because they definitely got some hot girl stuff on the site again i checked it out it was not checking for me but um, I was able to get some things that I feel like really got me outside of my box. I mean, you can see I'm like feeling myself in this look. So I'm loving this one. And uh, voila, as always, per usual, I say the best for Lizest. <laughs> All right, you guys. So, yes, I know what you're saying. She is so predictable. It is true. But when it works, it works. So this is my favorite. Now, aesthetically, I would probably choose one of the other two, but just in terms of wearability and go-tos, this is it right here. Because if you have like a super cute cover up that you wanna rock, you know, you can wear this as something basic underneath. Um, I've already grabbed this as a crop top to go with, you know, other high-waisted items. If I was wearing something sheer and just needed some coverage at the bottom, these would be great to wear underneath something. And I think th this is probably like the, the thickest. I mean, it might be on par with the last two, but this is like a thicker bathing suit quality. It holds me well. Um, it's not like high, high waist. It doesn't completely uh, cover my belly button, but you know, it's high enough. It gives good coverage in the back, and it's, it's black, like, But this is definitely my favorite. I would definitely recommend this one. If you just want a super basic, you know, two-piece, something that you can rely on, something that you can throw on, if you want to, you know, get in the water and get it wet, you can definitely do so without any problems or qualms. If you're planning on a vacation and you know, you might just wanna throw on some shorts or throw on a little scarf cover up and then be able to go in shops and stores. It's kind of like you're already have on a, a top. So this is perfect for that. This is my favorite one. And yeah. <laughs>
All right, you guys, so this was our final look. This two-piece black swimsuit. I just threw on this shirt. This is a shirt that I got from Boohoo. It's actually a long shirt. So, um, you know, like I said, if you wanted just to throw a cover up over top of this, this is a great piece. And that is it for our video. But before you go, if you made it this far, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. My subscribership is growing very slowly and I would love, love, love for you to help me uh, continue with that growth. I definitely uh, thumbs up Icon Swim. And uh, I think that's it. <laughs> Hi. <laughs>